form. Today, we will learn about expanded form. Are you ready to learn, kids? So, let's start. Let us define first what is expanded form. Expanded form is a way of writing a number to show the value of each digit. In expanded form, put together the value of each digit, then write how many thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. As an example, here is the number 185. This is in standard form. Let's write this number in expanded form. First, write 185 in the place value chart as number 1 in the hundreds place, 8 in the tens place, and 5 in the ones place. Next, add the values of its digits. So, 100 is equal to 100. 8 tenths is equal to 80. And 5 ones is equal to 5. 100, 80, and 5 are called values. Last, Let's write 185 in expanded form. Don't forget to put a plus sign in between them. We have 100 plus 80 plus 5. Another example. We have 307 in standard form. So, first, let's write 307 in the place value chart. As number 3 is in the hundreds place, 6 in the tens place, and 7 in the ones place. Next, find the value of each digit. So, 300 is equal to 300. 0 is 0 because there is no 10. And 7 ones is equal to 7. Last, write 307 in expanded form. Let's add the values of its digits. So, 307 is equal to 300 plus 0 plus 7. Now, let's do the short form of the expanded form. When we add the expanded form, we get the short form. Example, here is the expanded form of 500 plus 10 plus 4. How many hundreds are there? Yes, it's 500. So, we will write 5. How about tens? Correct, it's 1. We write 1. Last, how many ones are there? Yes, it's four. We write four. So, 500 plus 10 plus four is equal to 514. Good job, kids! This is the way to write the short form of the expanded form. Always remember that the expanded form of a number is the sum of values of all its digits. That's all for today, kids. Hope you enjoy learning. See you in the